Now, when it comes to cooking any kind of meat on the bone, there's a real technique. I've got some beautiful loin lamb chops here, and I'm going to show you exactly how to cook them. What you need to do first of all, and this is probably pretty foreign to most people, is take them out of the fridge a good hour or so before you actually cook them. You want the, the temperature of the meat to come up close to room temperature. Next, you want to cook them in a nice hot pan. So preheat that and let it go for a good three or four minutes until it's nice and hot. Season it before you put it into the pan. So a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper, and that's going to give a beautiful flavor to the outside. Both sides. So we start with the salt and the pepper, and then we flip them all over and do the same on the other side. You could use any kind of dry rub if you want to use some chili oil or some cumin or um, you know any kind of dry rub or spice mix that you wanted to mix up, that would be fine. I personally am a lover of the flavor of the lamb, so I keep it really simple. Next, I use a tiny bit of olive oil, not much at all, because I'm going to show you a little trick here that is really going to change the way you cook lamb, I promise you. On the outside, there's a nice big layer of fat. Delicious. Of course, this is very lean on the inside. So what you want to do is start it fat side down in a really hot pan. It's going to caramelize that fat. It's going to render some of it down. It's going to give you a beautiful cooking medium and a lot more flavor. Right, so I stand all of my lamb chops up together so you can literally pick it up like that and then place the entire thing into a pan. Now, whether it's into a pan or a barbecue or onto a grill pan or a griddle, it really doesn't matter. What does uh, matter is that you've got a nice high temperature. Now, right before your eyes, you can see the fat just start to melt off the bottom of that, that lamb chop, which is perfect. You then turn it down and then have a look at the side of this chop. You've got this beautiful golden caramelization, which is exactly what we were hoping for. Because it's got a nice thick bone, it is going to take a little while for that heat to penetrate. So you're going to leave these for about two, two and a half minutes on either side. Take your lamb chops once they've had a couple of minutes, put them onto a plate, make sure they rest before you serve them. The inside of these lamb chops are going to continue to cook. The temperature sort of travels right through to the core of that lamb chop, so you get a beautiful even pink. There is nothing better than the perfectly cooked lamb chop. So now you know how to do it. You know what's for dinner.